Retro Rob plays everything. Hey Rob here, it's time for GPD Pocket Watch, where I show you great games you can play on your GPD Pocket. This week, that's <laughs> kind of creepy. It came from space and ate our brains by Triangle Studios. And uh, it came up back in 2015, I think. It's an indie game, dual stick shooter, very minimalistic uh, appearance, but it's got a bit of depth of gameplay. Quite a bit of fun. I think it's about $10 on Steam. Actually, I don't think. I actually know that it's about $10 on Steam. It shows up on sale pretty regularly, so you might be able to get it for less than that. Um, let's go real quick through the settings. 1280 by 720, and then, of course, medium quality. Um, you could probably get a little bit more speed out of it by doing uh, low quality. Don't put it on high quality. I found it just bogs a little bit when there's a lot of things on screen so medium seems to be about the best setting for that and let's uh hit play i've actually had this game kind of simmering in the background for probably about a year now it originally was going to be done on the gpd win as a video but i don't think it ran on it i think there was something that wouldn't let it run uh, so i've just been kind of playing it on my laptop but then i tried it out on the win and found out guess what you can indeed play it on here. So again, uh, basic dual stick shooter controls, uh, left stick, right stick. You're gonna want a gamepad for this particular one. Uh, don't don't use a keyboard and a mouse. It doesn't work that well with it. Run! run. And there's more coming. Oh yes, indeed. Isn't just this all the time. Yeah, those flip frogs don't show up. I do not like them. I'm backed up into a corner. That happens a lot too. No! Come on. I get hit? Yeah, I did. Oh, <sighs> stupid frogs! They will take you out. These like frog-like monsters—they just have an amazing hop distance. <sighs> what I'm looking for is there are some help packages uh, scattered around the map. Find them. Shoot. I have but one heart left. So I'm not doing real well here. Oh, there's a pickup. There's two. There we go. Use that extra hit point, thank god. Sometimes you get weapons as well. Oh, lost it again. Come on! Cut me a break. Alright, gotta hurry between waves. Got a weapon, a temporary weapons upgrade. Uh, if I hit Y, by the way, go in here and there's uh, weapons and items that I can purchase and you can purchase them you know like right there you can upgrade your weapons or you can pick up new ones I happen to like the machine gun quite a bit I'm gonna hold off a second on that because I've already got a pickup that gave me one temporarily you can also pick up a med kit which gives you one extra hit point which is quite useful too and other pickups okay why to get back out of it <laughs> no, you don't. Oh, come on. Alright, so now it's going to be back to my machine gun, which I could use right now anyway. And purchase. Equip. And I've got an upgrade for it right away, so uh, am I going to do that? Yeah, I'm probably going to do that right away. Why not? 
Sometimes you pick up money. And that's really helpful too, especially when you're low on health like I am. You did some stupid crap. I'm getting out of here. Love the art direction in this, though. There's a big one. Rockets. Oh, that's it. I'm dead. Son of a... Mm. <laughs> Sorry about that jump cut. Uh, I had a uh, unexpected laughing jag about how horrible my commentary was. So, uh, a little bit more concise this run. <laughs> um, what do I like so much about it? Well, I love dual stick shooters, obviously, and if they've got good controls, I generally tend to like them, and this one does indeed have good controls. Um, I also like the fact that they shake it up a little bit with some weapons upgrades. Uh, I think that the graphic style is really kind of neat and fresh and original. I mean, I love 8-bit graphics games, don't get me wrong, I love that kind of bit nappy style, but it's nice to see some early looking 3D, but it's been updated with modern shading. It looks really good, I really just like that look quite a bit. Um, well designed game, 10 bucks I think, that's, that's pretty decent for it, fair enough. Giving it a big old thumbs up. Not a big surprise, because I try to avoid doing thumbs down games. Anyway, I like to know I like it. And if you liked this video, <laughs> and my eyebrows, what the heck was with that? Give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more. See you in a couple days. Retro Rocks Gaming Videos